Hey everybody, IHTW here. So this is part three of my fake rock background build. As you can see, the base coat is all done. As uh, you saw in the last video, it's basically all dry now. So what I'm gonna do is gonna grab some of this light gray. Let me focus on it. So I'm gonna use this light gray paint and then uh, basically just put a little bit here and then uh, spread it out so I have barely any paint on my paintbrush of this and then just lightly brush all over. Um, it'll give it a rock-like look and hopefully I'll be able to do some other stuff to it which I'll get to uh, if I actually have the time to. So let's just do the dry brushing with the, the light gray. So this is the amount of paint I'm actually using. It's very little. I may have actually put on too much but this is all I'm going to use to uh, lightly brush over everything and uh, it's going to look pretty cool once I finish. So if you can see here, um, all this rock here that looks lighter is what I've pretty much done. Then this side I haven't done yet, so I'm going to do a nice close-up for you guys so you can see what it looks like. So if you can see, there's just some very light brushes of uh, light gray. And uh, it makes it look that much more realistic um, compared to the ones without it. You can see the difference. It's pretty drastic if it's actually more drastic in real life this camera is making it look kind of funky but um, all I do just grab a little paint I actually needed a little more paint than uh, I originally thought but whatever so I lightly take it and then just brush off most of it on some paper and then just do that really simple no need for any artistic touch whatsoever just lightly brush on some paint and it'll look pretty awesome so I'm gonna go ahead and finish everything else for you guys. Okay, so here it is, pretty much uh, all finished with uh, that first part. Now it is pretty cool that the second layer's been applied and it looks awesome. You can just have a little close up at all the rocks. Looks great so far, there's the other hide. Um, and there's the other one. So now that that is done, I'm gonna wait about 10, 15 minutes until it all dries really quick. Then I'm going to apply some green so it looks like uh, some moss is growing on it. Um, and then afterwards I'll be adding a lot more stuff to make it more realistic. Once I get my sealant, which I should be able to do sometime this week, I'm not sure. But I'll be right back to apply that green stuff. Okay, so it's dry now and I just got some green paint and I'm planning on just grabbing some, just dabbing it on the underneath of some of these rocks. Um, in places where light often wouldn't get to is where I'm going to put it on so it can look more realistic and more natural. So, uh, yeah, let's do it. Okay, so if you can see somewhat, I added a little tint of green to every underside of a rock and any shadow that it would cast. Um, so any dark places that I see with any shadows, I just painted it a um, little, little bit of green. So anywhere that I think light wouldn't get to very well would have some green as you can see right here. All along the bottom, the back here, underneath that little ledge, um, over here on this side quite a bit. Um, same thing over here, so it looks really nice. So later on I'm going to grab some fake plants, I'll be putting it on here which will look a lot better. So pretty awesome. So yeah, that's pretty much it for today until I, I start sealing and adding more stuff to it. So yeah. Hope you guys liked the video, and I'll see you guys later. Cool.